Well, ladies and gentlemen, this is Lens Island Early Access. So in Lens Island, you will build, fight, farm, and explore. Experience your own path, whether it's building the home of your dreams, tending to your crops and watching the sun go down, or exploring the mysteries of the island in the darkness underneath. But you may want to take a sword with you. How's it going, everyone? This is Lens Island Early Access, developed by Flow Studio and published by Flow Studio as well. I want to give a huge thanks to the publishers for giving me a key to actually check out this game for you guys here on the channel. Really excited to play this game. It was on my wish list for a long time now, and here we are uh, with Lens Island. Um, <clears throat> this is going to be a more slow-paced type of game that you're not used to on the channel here, but I hope that you guys do enjoy. Please, it would really mean a lot to me if you would hit the like button and subscribe if you are new. The most important thing about a series starting up is if we can get enough people on board, right? So if we can hit maybe 50 likes on this video, we'll continue with Lens Island. Till then, let's go ahead and continue. So our world name, let's let's do it serious here. Let's go. This is Cans Topia. I've never used this in any game before, but we're going to do it here. Cans Topia. Uh, how do you control Len? <laughs> I would like to do that with the controller. I really would. But um, I guess we're going to be doing with uh, Waz, right? Developer recommended is Mouse, however. In that case, I'm going to go with a recommendation here. Very well. Where is Len from? Uh, the Aro Islands, the Zengard City, the Acacia Plains, or the Garth Hinterlands. Now, does any place have anything special about them, or just the name? Oh, I see the character actually kind of changes there. Hmm, interesting. I kind of like the Garth Hinterlands. Yeah, let's go with the Garth Hinterlands. What is Len's facial type? Well, he's masculine, of course, I would hope, at least for me... Because I'm going to try to base this character off of me as much as I can. Does Len wear shoes? Well, I guess he doesn't. No. <laughs> Alrighty, let's see here. Um, yeah, so I'll try to go based off of me in real life here as much as I can. I mean, you know, it is what it is. Uh, ooh. Dark brown hair. Yes, yes, yes. Does he wear a coat? Does he wear a vest? I kind of like the vest. I will, I will say. I wore a vest for Thanksgiving. For the first time, my family laughed at me. So maybe that's not the way to go. <laughs> uh, let's just do a plain t-shirt. Nothing too crazy about that. And then I guess... Oh, the color of the t-shirt. Well, you know what? Let's go with blue. That's my favorite color. Uh, do we wear pants? Yeah, of course we wear pants. We always wear pants. There's no black pants, I see. But, you know, I guess we'll do with what we gotta do. I like the baggy style here, so we'll go with that. Okay, so let's go ahead and start the game. All right, so here we are. It looks like we have crash landed with our raft here on this island of some sort. Now, this is going to be a complete, um, sorry, this is going to be a complete blind playthrough, so I have no idea what to expect. So if there's any angst and pains, I do apologize in advance, but, uh, you know, that's just how it is with some of these series, right? So manage your hotbar and backpack. So drag unlocked items onto your hotbar to equip them or drag at an item or drag an item off your hotbar to unequip it. Oh, that's very easy. Any unequipped hotbar items are automatically sent to your chest for storage. Okay, good. Uh, the Traveler's Backpacks are here. All of your resources are accessible from your backpack at any time and do not require storage. Equip food items by dragging them directly from your backpack to your heart hotbar. Okay, so in our chest, we have, it looks like a knife. Yeah, a Bowie knife. That's not a knife. This is a knife. Very well. So I guess we would... Oh, we already have that, right? We, we, we Yeah, we already have that. I guess this is the second one, maybe? Maybe? <laughs> I don't know. Tools? Okay, no. This is just what we have all together. I see. Okay. So we have our we have our weapon. We have our tools. And that's basically all we have in our chest. Now there... Whoa. Hello. Oh, I see. Oh, I see. You have to hold R. That's very interesting. So we picked up a glass bottle there that gave us some glass. Very good. Um, Do we just send it? Okay, so time each attack to trigger a critical hit for more melee damage. You can deal more damage timing your hits instead of holding down to auto hit. Hmm. Time your next swing when you see the circle, uh, when you see the crit circle expand during the crit window to trigger a critical hit, deal bonus damage. Okay, so very, very well. Yeah, okay. I, I messed up there, but for the most part, we got it going on. 
Uh, so any survival crafting exploration game, I think the first thing to do is probably craft <laughs> or try to get materials as much as we can. Anytime I played Minecraft in today, I will say that uh, getting wood was a top priority. I do have to say though, the, the 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 controls with the mouse scheme is a little weird. So I'm gonna go over to uh, Wazd, and I'm sure that will be fine. I haven't checked uh, any of this. Yeah, I haven't checked any of this. I would like my frame cap, frame cap, real quick. There we go. This is what you gotta do sometimes. Okay, very well. Okay, that is way more natural. I'm so glad I moved over to the Wazd. What the heck is this? Do we take this? With this, or do we have to use a pickaxe here? I don't know. I think this is fine. All right. I'll just sit here and bash away. Now, this is kind of curious because look at it, it kind of is like a shelter already made for us in a way, right? In a way, in a way, of course. Old note we followed the orders, the bridges have been destroyed, and the second cave entrance demolished. We will be heading back early in the morning. Very well. Can we destroy that, you think? No. Okay. All right. So one thing at least is that uh, I, I mean I guess we have something started here, not to our own pleasure, but I mean we have something in case of anything, right? But I, I think we should probably just go on and keep exploring. I mean it is early in the day. Let's use our time wisely, right? I like to think that. Oh, look at this. What's going on over here? Oh, this must be the broken bridge that the note talked about here. Let's see. 80 stone and 80 limestone. Very well. Where does this go to? This goes to Bridgewater Town. Interesting. All right. Very good to see. If you guys want to pick up this game and check it out, or if you really love this, or if you really enjoy this series, or you like what you see already, you can go ahead and do so on Steam. Uh, you know, add it to your wish list, or, you know, pick it up now for $24.99 USD as well. I forgot to say that in the beginning, so I figured I'd say it now. <laughs> Now is better than ever. Now, what is this? Okay, so this is actually something we can mine. Very well. Let's see. It looks like dirt. <laughs> I'll be honest. Uh, maybe like sandstone or like a clay type material, maybe. I don't know. It is starting to look more like clay now. I'm not hitting my crits, I will say. Now, if we were to check out our inventory, that is I. That is clay. Okay, good. Okay, wonderful. So we have that, we have our food, and we have our building, which we can craft anything right now, which is kind of cool. We have farming, where we can do the farming, uh, stone well, and all that. Now, the purpose of farming is for what, right? We don't really have a, um, a hunger bar of... So oh, God, I don't want to hit that with that. We don't have, like, a hunger bar of any sort. But maybe health, right? Obviously, we, we're going to have battle. We're going to have to go into battle at some point or another. It kind of eluded, right? Uh, yeah, so I think health is going to be mostly done through farming or food, right? That's kind of cool. I do want to say if you are new to the channel, um, this is a game that is typically out of my comfort zone. So uh, if you think I come into here knowing I know everything, well, believe it or not, I don't know everything. <laughs> so we're going to be doing this together and I am certainly uh, always up for feedback from the community good criticism is always welcome bad criticism what are you doing right <laughs> bad criticism just gets you nowhere really it doesn't it really doesn't yeah so that's uh, my plan for this if it does continue of course depends you know if you guys like it let's continue right if you guys don't if you guys aren't interested then you know that's okay <laughs> You guys be the judge of the game, right? I'm just over here playing it. Looks like we're getting more, uh, not ice, but glass. Looks like we have another bridge over here, which is kind of interesting. How much does this need? Well, it needs fiber and it needs wood. Well, you know what? Let's actually get going here on the wood. We can actually make this bridge quite soon, actually. I don't know how much wood we get from an actual tree. We'll see here. There we go. Timber. Now, I wonder if the trees... Um, was that enough? How much did we get from that? I did not check. I should have seen there. 66. Yeah. <laughs> uh, this goes pretty by. This goes pretty fast. Okay. Um, I wonder if the trees do replant or regrow after a day or so. I'm not sure. Kind of interested to see how well the um, the night and day cycle is. I will say. Now we should be able to build this. Yeah. Yeah. Let's go ahead and repair that. Well, there we go. 
Where does that take us? Well, it takes us to another bridge. All right. This is probably going to be more daunting, right? Oh, no, the same. All right. So just 20 fiber. I'm assuming that's fiber or plants, whatever you want to call it. And uh, more wood. Awesome. Is there? Oh, there's a. Okay. I was going to say, is there a sprint mechanic? But no, there is a roll mechanic. Very well. Uh, what do I think about how the game looks right now? Well, the game looks pretty good. I do have to say, the game is actually really pretty. And I like that. I do like that, indeed. Now, if the game is a little bit too loud, I, I will turn it down here. Let me just go ahead and turn it down just a tick. There we go. Maybe that was too much. Maybe it wasn't. I don't know. I guess I'll see. That actually was a little too much. <laughs> that was pretty drastic. There we go. That's fine. All right. Let's go ahead and pick up some more wood. I'm sure that is not enough. And then let's go ahead and make sure we get some fiber. Yeah, like I said, um, I'm interested to see the day and night cycle. So far, it feels like daytime has lasted some time. Like, I want to say maybe so far we're almost 10 minutes into this. And, um, well, it's still daytime. There's no evening or anything like that. Now, I am a little bit nervous, I will say. Once uh, nighttime does come, you know, where are we going to go? Well, I, we have that... Well, that didn't give us any plant fiber now, did it? Uh, we have that little shack that I'm actually going to take uh, advantage of. Yeah, I'm going to take advantage of. Um, really, you could say, well, you should have built a place right off the bat. Well, yeah, you, you might be right. But what the heck, dude? Hey! Some bees in that tree. That was kind of nasty. How are we on the, on the fiber in the wood? Well, we have enough fiber. We just need a little bit more wood. But it wouldn't give me enough time. Right, I'm going back to what I was just talking about before I got rudely interrupted. It wouldn't have given me enough time to kind of explore and uh, build these bridges out. I don't know if these bridges are very important early on, but we're going to figure that again with the bees. I've played among trees. I know about bees. I do. I do. I do. I do. All right. So that should be enough to go ahead and build this second bridge. And we're getting things done, right? We're getting things done on day one, I guess. And who knows? Maybe I want to uh, build something over here. Build the house off in this direction. Hello? Ah. Maybe I want a house here. Maybe this is my house now. Holy crap. Hey. This is kind of cool. This is like our own private little island. Yeah? Okay, I'll be honest with you. I was not expecting that. But it does make sense now. <laughs> you see the like the cover of the games or like the screenshots of the games on Steam. And well, this is oh my gosh. This is it. My dog is kind of interrupting me right now. She's like pulling on some cords. Anyways, yeah, so this is kind of cool. So maybe this is where we actually post camp. Yeah, believe it or not. And this is, you know, don't believe it. Know it. This is it. I guess this is our home. Our home away from home. Whoa, wait. All right, so let's go, let's kind of dive in. Once we do a little bit of cleanup here, I want to dive into the crafting system here and see how well this does. Who knows? Maybe it's going to blow my socks off. Maybe. Just maybe. <laughs> Been watching too much of The Grinch lately. There we go. It is towards that time of the year, right? Christmas. Uh... Okay. <laughs> I got a little nervous there, I will admit. I was like, oh no, did we just break it? So we do have quite a bit of items here. Let's go ahead and take a look at some of this crafting. Yeah, why not? So I am seeing that we have a currency as well. We have like gold. Interesting. So what can we actually build as far as foundations go? Well, well like, hang on. Let's take a look here. We have a workbench. Essential for any home. Craft new items and access your tool chest. Very good. Uh, bed. We need fiber for a bed. Okay. We have a dining chair. A chair to sit on and think about at, during dinner. Small drawer. Drawer. Nothing that we need to really focus on quite yet. This is kind of something we need to focus on right now. This is our crafting for our, uh, you know, our, our foundation here. Now, uh, as you can see, it is getting now evening time. So we want a wooden ceiling. There's wooden walls. There's a there's a corner of a, you know, roof here. I'm looking for just straight up, like, like what happens? Let's see. Oh. Oh. So it actually throws you into a... Kind of like a builder's mode here. Interesting. Interesting indeed. So, okay. Okay. I wonder why we were able to snap it there. Is it because it needed, a structure needed to be, um, 
kind of held up, right? Held up. That's very interesting. <laughs> okay. What about a plot of land or like a farm plot? Well, we don't have enough for that. I see, I see. We just have a lot of resources that we just don't have unlocked. Okay, okay, okay. I see, I see, I see. Okay, well, what about a wall? Can I at least put a wall up here somewhere? Uh, we can put one there, but we can't put one there. Now, I wonder why we can't put one there. Uh, my guess is that because there is a wood of or a log right there. So let's see. Do we actually or are we a problem when it comes to crafting? Can things get in the way from us? And can we get into the way of things? So again, it doesn't really seem to snap as well as it did before, but that's all right. So yeah, now we can go ahead and place this and place, honestly, like maybe a window. Uh, well, actually, hmm, I don't know how I want to put this. You know what? Maybe not. So if we were to take away something, right? If we were to take away a wall, how would we, how would one take away a wall? I guess maybe if we were in the build mode, right click. No. Nope. Put us back in the build mode. If we were in the build mode, does it say here? Ah, so there's actually levels to this. Oh, okay, I see. All right, all right. What's F? This. Oh, okay. Cost to upgrade. Okay. Recycle. Okie dokie. All right. And then this and this and this. So we can see the inside, right? We can see this layer and then if there was more layers and more layers and more layers we could see all that as well okay very well all right i'm starting to learn i'm starting to learn as we go here now i do want to take out well this is actually kind of weird right it is a little bit weird how i have it here now this seems like a front type like a front part of a place of some sort so maybe i kind of build my um extension off into the back you know what i mean so let's let's see here so if i were to go is there like flooring options like a foundation flooring or do we have to just roll with the ceiling how does this work like if i wanted to do a floor i guess the foundation would be it but we need limestone and regular stone hmm okay okay well you know it is what it is it is getting late now um interesting now, I don't know what will happen if we were to sleep, right? If we were to sleep without any protection and all that. But we do need to get some fiber here. So let's see if we can manage to get some fiber real quick. And, of course, like some more wood. You know, we need some more wood. Now, I don't know if there's like a... Oh, actually, I see some health down there. It is very interesting to see now. Well, I do see the health bar. I, I have seen it before, but... I mean, it's starting to get lower. Now, I don't know if that's because of food issues. They were hungry. But that is very intriguing to see. Maybe four. Yeah, there we go. Ah, I think that yellow bar. Yeah, okay, so the yellow bar is the hunger in... Okay, okay, now I'm starting to see. I get you. So there is a hunger bar after all. Alrighty, so what I said in the beginning is happens not to be the truth very very well okay well at least now maybe we can uh, think about uh going ahead and placing oh i guess we don't have enough fiber so all right guess we got to roll back yeah so you could say um very unprepared right very unprepared night first night but that's to be expected right that's to be expected nothing too crazy here i do need to find food and i got to figure out how to grow right how to grow food there we go. Still a lot of materials that we need. I'm glad that we found a, a spot off over there. It is very dark, I will say. <laughs> it is very dark. My lord, it is dark. Let's see if I can brighten that up. I might have to do this post, uh, you know, post. Oops, let's do that. Yeah, I, I, I can't really I can't really do anything about that. Other than maybe brightening up post-production. So I'm, I do apologize. It's very dark. Maybe later on we'll be able to uh, get a torch of some sort. There we go. We at least got some more berries. There we are. It's going to eat some more berries while we have them. Yes, yes, yes. Now, this is kind of... This is kind of scary, you know? Don't fall into the water. I do not know what happens if you fall into the water. Limestone and regular stone is something that we want as well. Yes, yes, yes. Anyways, I think I might go through here and make you guys not watch the whole darkness thing. 
unless something happens. And what I'm going to do is really just kind of go around, get some resources, and I'll bring it back very, very soon. Well, good early morning there, everybody. Welcome. <laughs> I say welcome back. I know it's been a split second for you, but it's been a long night for me, for sure. Um, the night lasted eh, about around 10 minutes or so. And I've learned a lot. Uh, and, well, I've done a lot, really. I've been mostly gathering. I've learned that you can swim, so <laughs> don't uh, don't stress too much about that. But uh, I see a chest down here that I'm... Or not a chest, but I do see a barrel down here that I'm quite interested in. So I'm going to get into that real quick. Um, I've made some improvements. I, I have. I've made some drastic improvements to our um, to our home. And I hope you guys do enjoy it. I can't believe I freaking missed that. But yeah. Uh, so far, the music in this game is quite great, actually. Um, I'm really enjoying it. The nighttime. Hey, not at any time. Only when it was funny. Thank you for subscribing to the channel. Really do appreciate that, Kale Nichols. Um, yeah, so uh, it, it's it's very much so uh, a relaxing game to get into. Not as intense as I was expecting yet. I, I say that now, but I might uh, I might mark my words as the game progresses, of course. But I'm really enjoying my time here. But I just want to gather a little bit more wood so I can show you what has happened. Uh, no, we have not. Oh, man. No, we have not. Uh, we actually need food. Yeah, we actually need to find food quickly rather fast as well too um, i just now realized that that is not good for us so let's see what we can do real quick as far as finding food i think there's a couple berries right here that we can grab that will hold us over for now it's not a great uh resource of food that we have now i mean it, it does the trick for now but like i said we need to figure out a better strategy on uh, obtaining food here now oh there's some more just living off berries, aren't we? Aren't we just living off berries? Berries and wood, baby. Berries and wood. That's what we're living off of. Let me just go ahead and collect just a few more. Uh, I haven't I haven't put down a plot of land yet. I'm actually going to do that here with you guys. I'm going to put down a plot of land and see how well that goes. Uh, we might have enough resources to build the big bridge, believe it or not. Believe it or not. So, yeah. Anyways, let, let's head back so I can show you before things get a little too, a little too rowdy. Uh, yeah. But, uh, yeah. It was pretty nice. It was pretty nice just chilling out. Uh, you know, in some games, you think about nighttime is, is actually a, a bad time, right? Uh, very uh, chaotic time sometimes, depending, you know, if there's going to be bad people or bad monsters or bad guys or whatever might you wanna, might you want to say. But, no, that was pretty useful. That, like, that was usefully nice. Usefully nice? Is that a word? Usefully nice? Probably not. But, you know, we'll make it a word. It was nice, so therefore it was useful. Yeah, but here, check this out, guys. Look at look what I'm over here building. Admittedly, it's 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 <laughs> it is pretty big, right? Admittedly, it is pretty big, uh, what we have here. But um, we do have it, and it's here. <laughs> so, I mean, uh, and I've been learning the um, I have been learning the um, the building. It's really different. It, it it's definitely different, and um. I'm just getting used to it still. Let's just say that. I'm just getting used to it even more. Um, it, it's a little bit awkward at times, for sure, but that's all right. Now, I, I ran out of glass to make windows, so if I have the lack of windows here, I do apologize. It is what it is. This is a little too crazy big, right? A little too crazy big. Uh, really, what I want to get is simply just, just a bed. Yeah, a bed. And, uh, let's maybe just do that now. How about that, right? Scroll on down. Let's go here. Let's get a bed and get some farming going on. I would love to get that as well. So on the first level, sorry, the first level, uh, we will be putting down our bed. Let's rotate it the correct way. And we'll be putting it right there. We do want to make a workbench. And the workbench is going to go kind of right next to our bed here. Excellent. And then as far as pro uh, farming goes, look, we ran out of wood already. So we, we kind of get that in. Ay, ay, ay. There's a lot to do, isn't there? Always a lot to do. But at least we have a few things taken care of. So that's that. So it looks like we need to go get more wood. But check this out. I did put a front door here, kind of. Front door, back door, whatever you want to call it. I put a door here. Uh, we have the obvious obvious upstairs that is still being worked on. That's under construction. That kind of goes out to the balcony here, in case for whatever reason. But I've also constructed a door down here. Check this out. Look at that. 
yeah, kind of like a front step door. I don't know. I thought it was kind of cool. So a front door, back door access point. So that's really neat. Other than that, um, yeah, I guess I need some farming getting done. Farming in more wood, right? More wood. I hope that I, I didn't even I didn't even like click on the workbench that we had there. Now that we have the bed, it should we should be able to travel through the night quite uh, frequently. So I won't have to skip so much for you guys. So this might be better for both of us now. But yeah, I was a little proud of that. I, looking back at it now, I was like, well, that was a lot, right? Maybe that was too much of, uh, of resources used at once there, especially in the early game. But, uh, you know, I was feeling myself. I was feeling pretty good about it. So, you know, I kind of got lost in the hype there, lost in the sauce. But that's all right. We'll, we'll, we'll make up for it here. Now, I haven't gone back to the big bridge, the stone bridge, to see if we had the enough resources for it. Um, oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, no, no, no. That always surprises me. There we go. All right. <laughs> that always surprises me. Look at that tree. Look at all this wood. Nice. Now, I don't know if this is enough, but at least we're right here. Let's just head on back and see. Um, I want to finish up the upstairs, obviously. I would like to put, like, a foundation step here if I can. Is that even possible? Can I do that? Oh, baby, I can. Oh, great. Oh, fantastic. Yeah, let's put like a nice step right there so that we don't need to get stuck on that lip. I probably got to put it on the back door too. So we're going to do that as well. It does take limestone though. I, 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 hate, I hate that. I wish you could like move. Yeah, you can't move, can you? I wish you can move while in this mode. But you got to like, got to get out of the mode and come through. So I was thinking about putting the backyard, making the farm, right? Putting the farm in the backyard. I, I, I think that's a strong play. Maybe. I don't know. What's a strong play and what's not a strong play in this game? Your guess is as good as mine. But we'll do that and we'll do that. And that is all we have for resources, right? Yeah, that is all. Okay. So now that we have our farm plots here, I honestly, I have no idea what's next. Oh. Oh, well. Oh. Uh, yeah. Yes, yes, yes. Plant the blueberries. Plant all. Oh, good. Oh, great. Fantastic. That's easy. So let it, what about our workbench here? Can we do anything with this? No, it just does the tool chest, I guess. Okay. I, 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 all right. I'm starting to learn a little bit. Maybe not. <laughs> Maybe not. Maybe I'm not learning as much as I thought. But that's okay. A uh, small set of drawer to keep all your knickknacks and other small items in. Okay. We do have a well. A boar well used as a water resource for farming. Now, do I need to build a... Um, do I need to build like a water can? A canister of some sort? I don't know. Like, do I need to water these items? Just a little blueberry seedling. No, I don't want to crop it. <laughs> I could plant marigolds and I could plant uh, lavender and roses, but I, I don't think that's very, very important right now. I really don't. What is that on the ground? Oh, it's a tree stump. I wish I could get rid of some of this debris here. All right. Well, at least we know. Uh, let's head on over to the bridge. Yeah, let's head on over to the big bridge and see uh, what we have going on there. Maybe good, maybe bad, maybe enough, maybe not. I don't know. Was it off to the right here? I think it was. Really, at least I thought it was. Maybe it's off to the left. I'm going the wrong way here. Yeah, I think it's off to the left, maybe. Maybe. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, what is this pink thing here? Nothing? I think it's off to the left. If it's not off to the left, well, I guess we're going to run into something else. What is that in the ocean? Is that anything? Oh, glass. A glass bottle. I do hear, like, noises of possible animals. Okay, this is some limestone, right? We, we need this. There we go. I don't know if that's the correct term. I'm, I'm, I think that was what I read, limestone. I wear glasses for a reason. Can't see half the time. There we go. What is this? Let's, let's actually know the, the correct term here. Yeah, limestone. Okay, I was saying it right. I don't think I have enough stone, though, for this bridge. Now, looking at it. Oh. Check this out. Another barrel with more mechanical parts in it. Okay. Oh, and we just ran over some glass. Here's some more limestone. Yeah, I definitely don't think the bridge was off in this direction at all. That's okay. There we go. Should give off some stone as well, not just limestone. Or is it just strictly limestone? I think it's just strictly limestone. Okay. All right, all right, all right. 
Yeah, I think this is all new to us. There we go. Well, I'm glad that I get to experience this with you guys. This whole new area. Yeah, I just heard it again. It sounds like an elk or a deer of some sort. Really not sure. Or a duck? <laughs> how can you... How can you confuse the two? How can you confuse a mallard and a freaking elk? Well, I don't go hunting. I don't go outside very much. I know there's limestone over here. But I can't imagine that we can carry much more here any, any soon after this. I think we're almost at our limit here. Yeah, we are full of limestone. Very well. Now let's make sure to pick up some glass while we're here. Because we do need windows after all. What is this? More glass? Yep. Get some bottles. Wow, this island is a lot bigger than I was expecting, I will say. <laughs> yeah, a lot bigger than I was expecting. After all, this is Lens Island. There we go. Now, it is getting a little bit greener off here to my right. And I just realized that there is kind of like a path going on here. This is kind of strange. There we go. Yeah, look how much greener it's getting. I need to find food. Yo, what the heck is this? What is this? Um. Praise Buddha. Interesting. Okay. <laughs> I guess that's that. It's like an old ruin or some sort. I feel like I am definitely going off the beaten path here, though. Oh, there's a cave. Oh. Oh, well, I don't think I'm really ready to go into a cave quite yet. I, I, I just want to find the uh, the bridge to Bridge Tower Town, right? Is that what it was called? Bridge Tower Town? I think that's what it was called. Let's try to trek back before it gets too late here. Because it is getting dark, after all. Yeah, I think it's back over here. Wow. This game. You can definitely get lost here. You can definitely get lost. I'm going to try my best to keep my bearings. My lord, I don't remember any of this. I, I think mostly because I've never been over here. And this might be the beginning of where we started. Might be. Maybe I need to go off to the right. Uh, uh, right. Yeah, towards like the northeast. If we are saying that this is north here. There we go. If we find our raft. Oh, well, we find a tree here. So that's good. Maybe our raft went away. Maybe. There we go. More bottles. And there's our bridge. Interesting. <laughs> okay. Very, very interesting. So maybe the bridge is off here, off to the right. I would like to build this thing now. That's kind of why I'm like on it. I like, I want to build it now so that I don't need to worry about it. Or worry about the materials for it. But I'll be real with you. I'll be completely, completely honest with you. I don't remember where it's at. There it is. Okay. <laughs> All right, uh, let's repair a bridge. Bridge, sorry, bridge tower. It's Bridgewater Town. Oh, 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 look at that. Look at the art. How awesome. Bridgewater. Hello. Hello there. This is Mayor Gerald. Good to see you. How can I help? I was just passing through. What is this place, actually? Uh, this is Bridgewater Traveler. My name is Gerald. I am the mayor of this corner of the world. If you're settling on the land, or on the island, be aware of the darkness that lurks beneath it. Many travelers have come to the island in search for its powers. Few have ever returned. This town is built by travelers such as yourself, seeking new beginnings. And the island is a paradise for those who dare to live on it. Just be careful, my friend. Oh. Well, that probably explains the uh, cave there, yeah? Should probably, like, maybe not put... Have my... <laughs> have my machete in my hand. Now, I am running low on food. Maybe these people have anything to offer. As I try to steal their pumpkins. Anything in here? Whoa, it's an empty house. Interesting. Interesting. Oh, hello there. Who are you? Uh, hello. What a beautiful afternoon. Oh, all right. Oh. Buy? What is this? Oh, coin. Oh, sell wood. Oh, okay. He buys wood. Yeah, do you guys have anywhere that sells food by any chance? I would really appreciate that. Maybe like a little market. Ah, what's over here? A floral shop. Now, we could actually sell her flowers. Well, hello, this is Ashley. 
Can we sell you flowers? Uh, sell. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I guess she only buys like five at a time. There is a tailor shop there. Who is this? Alex, howdy there. It sure is a nice afternoon. Blacksmith, awesome. Bakery closed for sale. 2,000 coin. We can have our own bakery, you say? Hey, farmer's market. Yes. Well, hi there, Steph. My name is Steph. Um, wheat, no. Uh, blueberries, quite yes. <laughs> uh, what is this? Passion fruit? Uh, let's actually buy... Oh, wait, we can't afford it. We don't have enough. Oh, no. Oh, no. Do you have anything for cheap here, Steph? What about some bread? Yeah. I, I, I would like... No. Oh, I guess not. Uh, but we can sell some flowers here. If the flower lady still is open, we can definitely f sell some more flowers. Some more marigolds. Uh, and lavender. Oh, we don't have enough lavender. Okay. All right. Now, that should be enough. Keyword, should be enough for some bread. Please, sir. Can I have another? Thank you. Okay, now with the bread, can I eat my food? Yes. Excellent. How much hunger does this give us? Quite a bit. Okay, I think that's enough. Yes, I think that's enough food that we can have so we can bring back... Uh, we'll at least go back into town for now and check on our crops. Now, I don't know how long it will take for our crops to grow with the blueberries. It is getting dark now, so it is time to go to bed. But, I mean, might as well pick up some of these flowers to sell to the flower lady, right? It's very destructive of me, but, you know, she'll not know, right? Hopefully this guy doesn't tell on me. The mayor, I guess the only person he's going to tell on me is himself. He's going to tell himself on me. If that makes any sense. <laughs> All right, let's head back to bed and let's actually try out this uh, sleep mechanic and see how well this works. Again, I do apologize for how dark it is. I'm trying to get my way back there as soon as possible. We have been warned, though. We have been warned about the troubles of this island. I did get distracted here, I will say. We were warned. So at least we know there's a market. It's really cool that we can potentially buy ourselves our own bakery for two thousand coins or two thousand dollars very very cool to see very cool okay honey i am home i went through the wrong way but that's all right uh it's very dark in here i wonder if we can like get light of some sort let's go ahead and first of all save second of all let's go ahead and sleep oh great well here we are oh my god the trees came back oh no i don't know if i like that i mean cool but not cool <laughs> i don't know do I have to cut these trees down every two days or something? Ah, uh, yeah, yeah. Maybe unless I, I don't know, build on top of it. Ah, no, no. Bad bees, bad bees. I hate you bees. I hate you bees. It does look like our um, blueberries are not yet full, fully through. Now it might be because I need to build a well. I don't know. I really don't. I would think maybe a water can. Of course, but, you know, I, I've been wrong multiple times. Ah. Very good. Level one workshop. Ah. What is this? An iron hammer, an iron spear, an iron battle axe, an iron sword, and an iron shield. Very good. Uh, no, please. Let me get back into that. That was really cool. Farming. Guess we can make farm stuff. What is this? A signpost? Some more stuff. Okay. Um, nothing too crazy, I guess. Upgrade to level 2. 200 wood, mechanical, and shards, it looks like. Interesting. Hmm. Interesting indeed. But I think that's going to do it in today's episode. This is a good start of what we have now. Um, please, fire away with tips and tricks down below. I would really do appreciate that. It would help out my gameplay much more, much more indeed. Um, yeah, so if you guys like this and you want to see more, remember to hit that like button and subscribe if you're new for more content by me. And I will see you in the next video, wherever that may be. And do as always, take care. And now for my next number, I'd like to return to the classics.